it got bigger. But <laughs> as far as how much range you got, I have a little bit of a discrepancy about what we're actually getting. Mm -hmm. So right away, I'm going to tell you guys, we went from a 77 kilowatt battery to a 84 kilowatt battery. Now, the reason why I'm saying I have issues with the range that's being predicted is because in the United States, the change only gives you guys with the EPA assessed is nine miles, which equals out to 14 kilometers. So in theory, you'd be like, okay, so it gives us 14 more kilometers, but NRCAN assessment, they say it gives you an extra 50 kilometers of range, and it's because they calculate differently. There's an extra factor that the EPA calculates has to do with, um, what is it, real, real world differences. So they do like point, minus point something. Anyways, I'm not a mathematician. All I can tell you is there's a big difference between 14 kilometers and 50 kilometers. So maybe the truth is in between there, 25 kilometers or something like that. As far as charging, 250 kilowatt hour charging, 10 to 80% in about 20 minutes, really fast. High India as a whole do this extremely well. A lot better than the other manufacturers we have available here in North America. And it's definitely one of the fastest one. So the bigger battery, and one thing that we kind of notice as well is the gauges. I have different information in my gauges now. I asked you if you had that and you don't, so that must be something new for 2025 mm -hmm. is we have a minimal amount of range that you can get. So that is very good information. And then maximum. So maximum, I assume, is you're doing the speed limit, <laughs> you're, you're drafting a big semi truck, mm -hmm. and your HVAC controls is off. I would assume that's maximum. So here's a picture of what it looks like inside. So you definitely have a big discrepancy. So you're on equal mode, and the other ones, you're probably on normal mode driving like a normal person. Next, the big difference is a new trim came out. 